Welcome back to Getting Closer to My Core. And today I want to talk about the issue of feeling too wounded when I shouldn't feel too wounded. I know I share this with a lot of people and it is something I worked on for a lifetime and I've actually had a lot of help with it, not just through therapy, but through my very close friends where the issue would play out. I would say that if you ask the people closest to me, they would say the number one thing that is hard about me is that I can wound too easily. I have high expectations of people and I would, in my former years, more so than now, take things too personally and get too hurt by people's actions. And what I learned is that, and I teach this to everyone because I really had to learn it. And I'm gonna say, this year I might have fully let this go. I mean, I got better and better and better over the years that I worked on myself. But that people can love you and still disappoint you at the same time. And when you feel disappointed, when I feel disappointed, it's not because anyone has actually done anything wrong to me, it's just that they don't see the world the same way or they have a different operating system or their needs are different and they can't meet my needs exactly the way I would like them to. And I try to teach this to everyone that people can love us and hurt us at the same time. And then it goes to my saying of just because you feel it doesn't make it true. If I feel wounded, it doesn't mean someone's actually wounding me. It means something old is being triggered and it's something that didn't get met in my childhood that I'm expecting someone present day to meet. And it's not their job to make my needs get met because I miss them young. So for me, it definitely came from my childhood as it does for everybody else. And in my home, from an emotional perspective, there were times where I felt misunderstood. Um, and it does come from mother and father and it meant that they were plugging into one thing emotionally where I was feeling something else at the time. It made me a, an incredibly good shrink, but at times it really hurt me personally. And so through a lot of therapy, through getting to my core and unraveling it, I have taken an issue that wounded me. I mean, this was my biggest wound ever. And now I really think it's like, it's not gone, but it really is small. And so when it shows up, it, I can do something with it very quickly. Anyway, I hope this helps you. Go get closer to your core and I'll see you soon.